Hey everybody, in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to enter credit card transactions in QuickBooks Online. So without any further ado, let's get started with today's video. The first step is to access the bank banking section. So log in into your QuickBooks Online account and navigate to the banking or transactions section. This is where you can manage your bank and credit card transactions. The following step is to connect your credit card account if not already connected. If you haven't already connected your credit card account to QuickBooks Online, click on the option to connect a new account. Follow the prompts to provide the necessary information and credentials to link your credit card account to QuickBooks Online. This will allow for automatic importing of credit card transactions, making the data entry process easier. The next step is to import credit card transactions if connected. So if your credit card is already connected to QuickBooks Online, you can import credit card transactions directly. Click on the option to import transactions and select your credit card account. QuickBooks Online will teach, will fetch the la latest transactions from your credit card account and display them for review. The fourth step is to review and categorize transactions. So review the imported credit card transactions to ensure accuracy match each transaction with the corresponding expense income or other relevant account quickbooks online may automatically categorize some transactions based on past entries or rules you have set up however you should review and make any necessary adjustments to ensure accurate categorization the last step is to save and reconcile transactions so once you have reviewed and categorize the credit card transactions save the entries quickbooks online will now reflect the transactions in your accounts to maintain accurate financial records it's important to regularly reconcile your credit card account reconciliation involves matching the transactions in quickbooks online with your credit card statement to ensure all transactions are accounted for and accurate so this is how you do it guys thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video very soon peace